Okay, so obviously this isn't my room, but you know, just, just bear with, just bear with. Visiting a few friends, um, True Triz has came over from America, so we are doing a various amount of things in the UK that he hasn't done. You know, when someone from like a different country comes to the UK and they're like, I want to go to London, I want to see like fucking red post boxes and fucking, I don't know, the National Guard and fucking Nando Nando's. I finally got my camera back. Look at this, this is exciting. See this right here, camera. Got a new one. Basically just stopped making videos when I lost my camera because I just felt depressed. I was just like, this is fucking shit. And using my other camera just isn't ideal because this one's just better. And it's just comparing the two is just like, well, I'm just not going to do this if it's not this one. But yeah, we went to an escape room today. Um, there's quite a few of them. There's one in Manchester where I live, um, but I've never actually been to it. But now I've been to this one, I kind of want to go to that one. Um, you weren't actually able to record when you were in there, so I just kind of, you know, <laughs> sneakily got some clips. But I'm going to cut out most of it because I don't want it to, if anyone's watching it and they're going to go to the same place, I want it to ruin it for them. Because it, it fucking, you're in there for an hour, you get locked in a room for an hour, and then there's like five or six different rooms and you have to try and solve all these puzzles and become like an investigator and then try and escape at the very end. It's fucking hard. But yeah, we eventually won. Um, so I just throw a few clips up and stuff as I'm talking. Like in the first room, we had to go in and it's like, we're completely locked in the room, you can't get out. And you have to try and open a chest, and then in that chest there were some chains, and then we had to go and get a key from the other room to open that, solve a different crime in that room, and then that would lead us to another room, and you just kept going from room to room to room, trying to find out who murdered this person, and then how to escape, because he's going to come back in an hour and kill you. So, you know, that kind of idea gets you motivated. I mean, no one's actually going to come and kill you, but you don't fucking know that. Well, if you've never been to an escape room, you just kind of have to, because it was just, it was great, and like the adrenaline was pumping the whole way through, because we all just thought we were going to die, and there's like scary music playing, and there's like no lights, you happen to use a torch, like you're walking around with a torch because you can't see anything, and it's just great, and they've got like like um, like little videos that you have to watch, the, and then like you have to dissect them, and then you have to find like secret clues, and then you have to get numbers to open some padlocks, to find keys, to open more doors, and it's fucking, oh god, it's great. But yeah, this whole week is going to be insane. We've got the TGF meal on Saturday. We've got London, oh, paintball on Sunday. We're going paintball on the TGF on Sunday. Um, I'm going to get like a GoPro, strap it to my camera, use this camera as well. We'll have like, fucking, have, like seven points of views. It's going to be sick. So basically from this day till like next Wednesday, there's going to be some sick, sick videos again. So you know, videos like, channels are just going to die. Fuck off. I know everyone's like, oh, gone again. Just give up again. No, don't forget to subscribe. Because then you get to, you know, watch them. And then... You know, that's just, you're just gonna be great then, isn't it?